This is a work of fiction and is no way based on true events. Right? Shh, uh, here he comes. Close the door behind you. Thank you, Mr. Martins. Have a seat. Thank you. What's this about? <laughs> I've got a bakery to get to. Tony, we're gonna cut to the chase. We're suspending you pending termination. You're firing me for what? We feel strongly you're not fit to work. What, in the bakery? The whole store. Is that right? I've never been written up. Remember when I gave the kid the Heimlich and saved the company a lawsuit? Now I'm not good enough? I don't fit in? That may be so, Mr. Martins, but you have a habit. It's disgusting. What about me is disgusting? Oh, I see. This is because I'm Portuguese, isn't it? I will sue you guys for racial discrimination. You pick. What? You pick your oh. nose. It's not a racial issue, Mr. Martins. It's a hygiene issue. You're a picker. No, I'm not. Um, may I? Please. Observe, Mr. Martin. Exhibit A. Potato salad. Yeah, it's potato salad. That's relish. We put relish in our potato salad. Exhibit B, Mr. Martin. Banana pudding. That's old, but it's not snot. Are you guys new here? Yeah. Exhibit C. Your work apron. That's a lot of boogers. Uh, it's an old apron. We have a coworker who already squealed on you. He told us everything. Who? Who is this person? Bring him in. But I'm not done with him yet. Bring him in now. Oh my God, Jeremiah! Ah! Tony! Tell them what they want to know. Tell them what they want to hear. They need business. Tony, they put things inside me. Way inside me. Tell them what they want to know, Tony. Tell them you pick. Tell them you pick. Get him out of here. No! Tony, tell him! Jeremiah! Tony, they're still inside me! Please! Go so, Tony, on. what do you have to say for yourself? You bastards! Oh, yeah? We have you on video. There you are, Mr. Martins. On the company clock. Going back and to the left. Back and to the left. We caught you ready. What? You're doing it now! Wait a minute. You guys had video surveillance this whole time and you still tortured Jeremiah? Regardless, you picked on camera. Fine. Fine. You got me. I'm a disgusting picker. I I'm the only one that picks my nose around here. I must be the only one who eats out of the garbage disposal or poops in the, in the shower. It just, I love Lucy's it. I love Lucy's it right down the drain. We gotta get it all out. I'm the only one. And now you're just gonna throw me out like a dog. Like love don't live here anymore. Can I can I can I step out for a second? Yeah, well, let's take a break. Guys, I'm so sorry. I have a weak stomach. It's okay. We're almost done. But does this happen often? I've never seen anything like this. No. It's Tony Martins. He's a special case. You don't deserve this uniform. You don't deserve that shirt. You don't deserve those pants. You don't deserve any of it. All you deserve is rock bottom. Can I get a copy of the video? Oh, yes. Good. We're gonna make an example of this Tony Martins. He's a bad apple. Our customers deserve better than that. We're gonna set a standard for our employees to follow the rules and regulations. Otherwise- Oh my God! Hey, you guys. You guys are right. I don't deserve any of this. <gasps> That's what he spit in. <laughs> I guess my job here is done. I wish I could tell you Tony fought the good fight and kept his job. 
But Tony was terminated immediately. Tony Martins, my friend. The baker who picks his nose. P.S. Has anyone seen Jeremiah? Hey, so I was fired over a year ago, but get this. They put me on full unemployment with food stamps, which freed up a bunch of extra money for drugs. <laughs> Thanks, COVID. I didn't pick you. You picked me. Lunchtime. Lunchtime.